Hey YouTube, T here. I'm going to do a quick unboxing of the Lenovo Yoga 2. I just picked it up from Best Buy last night. Been looking for a 2 in 1 for a while. Um, still enjoying my, my Chromebook, but kids have kind of kind of taken it for a bit of a spin and uh, I'm letting them use it a lot. So, been looking for a 2 in 1 for a while. Um, I went up to Watched a bunch of videos on them, on some different ones. This is the one I decided on um, for different reasons. Power cord. Uh, I wasn't sure if I wanted one that would actually detach from a keyboard. Um, and in the end, I really just I decided I, that's not something I wanted to deal with. Uh, it's pretty. What I wanted was something that would fold all the way over, turn into a tablet be able to be used several different ways and still be um, still be functional and in one piece at all times. For some people they may not like that but that's what I wanted and that's one of the reasons I chose this particular model among the other price um, everything else but what I really like about it is is the ability to be in just standard laptop mode like so um, this is what they call, I believe, uh, stand mode. You know, watching a video at your desk or whatever. Um, then of course, there's the tent mode that I like, and then the full on tablet mode, either way in your hands. So that's the reasons I decided on this one. I'm going to go ahead and uh, stop the video for now. I'm going to go ahead and set out this up. I'm not going to do a long, drawn-out video on why, why can you watch the setup and everything. But I'm going to set it up, play with it a while, and then I'll come back and show you and let you know what I think. All right, guys, I've had time to charge it up and set up my account to play with it a little bit. Um, I'm really liking this, liking this uh, two-in-one. Uh, like I said in the previous part of the video, um, I wanted a two-in-one, and that's really... The key in that is the two-in-one. I wanted it to be in one. Um, and that's what this machine is. There you go. It's tent mode. Um, switched over. Good. And there we go. Tablet mode. What was that one? Stand mode. There you go. Stand load and back to laptop mode. That's exactly what I wanted when I was trying to decide which one of these PCs or laptops or two in ones or all the different kinds of combos they have now. This is what I wanted it to do. This is perfect. Um, this is my first time with Windows 8.1, so I can't tell you much about that. I haven't had Windows and maybe four or five years. Um, just been using my phone or I've had a Chromebook for the last year that that I like it. Um, but my kids, something that my kids use now, this is what I was looking for. Um, I'm not going to get into too much of the technical stuff about it. There's plenty of reviews on that. Uh, whether it's Amazon, Walmart, Best Buy, where I got it. All kinds of reviews everywhere. I read a lot of them. Um, it seemed like you, I would read 15 good reviews and then maybe one bad one that just either sounded like they got a, they got a, a lemon or they just didn't know what to do with it. Didn't know how to operate it. I'm not sure. But I go through the basics here. Um, it's got an Intel N3540, uh, Pentium processor at 2.16 gigahertz, uh, four gigabytes of RAM. 500 gigabyte hard drive. It is not, uh, I mean, it's not not a big gaming, it's not something you'd use for gaming or something. It's a good basic machine. Um, exactly what I need for everything I'm going to do or I'm going to let my kids do. Probably not going to let them touch it for the most part. Uh, they can play with the Chromebook. Um, we'll go over some of the ports we have here. Let's see, this is the left side of our AC charging port, the USB 3.0 port. Oh, sorry, I'm going to get right where you can see a little better. I don't know. 
if that's focusing very well or not. Anyway, AC charging point, USB 3.0, SD card slot, HDMI out. Left side, or excuse me, right side with the power button. I'll be honest with you, I'm not sure what that little button is yet. I haven't had a chance to, to play with it long enough. Um, this is the screen lock, so if you don't want it to rotate, uh, volume up and down, and the uh, headphone jack, and this is a USB 2.0. So it's got everything that I wanted with it. I'm not sure if that meets what you're needing. Excuse me. Oh, got to put in the password. Hold on. Anyway, this is the Livono Yoga 2.0. Not 2.0. It's the Livono Yoga 2 11 inch. The particular actual serial number on this one is, or not serial number, the name, or the model number is the 20332. So I know there's different versions of this that have come out. This is the one that's in Best Buy stores right now. I paid $479.99 for it. I um, actually bought it online and picked it up in store. Uh, and I did that for a particular reason. I'll tell you about that in a minute. Uh, I'm not that familiar with 8.1, but click around in it a minute. It takes you to your desktop. Takes you back to a little start screen. I'm getting used to having the, the touch part of this. It's pretty fast. I think if you slide back like that, it takes you to the last thing you were at. Um, this takes you out of some other shortcuts. So anyway, like I said, I'm not going to get into all the technical stuff with it. Um, all the stuff about the Windows 8.1. You can find that in another video. Um, it's sturdy. Uh, let's see if we can go... I'm sure you're going to want to hear some sound. Let's go find some sound real quick. I don't know what I'm choosing here. Let's just find something. That is volume 100% up. Full screen. Oh, this, this looks kind of disturbing. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure how to use the YouTube app in this yet. Uh, let's get something with somebody singing, maybe. I don't know what this one is. Let's see. Get a little music to it. Speakers are actually bottom of the unit. So I've heard, um, I've heard laptops with a little bit better sound than this. Uh, the Chromebook that I have doesn't have anywhere close to the set to the sound of this one, especially volume-wise. So I'm actually kind of impressed about the amount of volume I'm getting out of that. Now that's with the speakers being right here, so I'm probably getting a lot of it out out from the side. Um, you know how it would sound. Is the tablet with the speakers being covered up? I don't know. I guess we can try that. It actually still puts out quite a bit of sound, so I'm happy with the sound on this. Way happier than the sound I was on my uh, little Acer Chromebook I have here. I actually still like this Chromebook um, for just its simplicity. And that the kids can use it and it doesn't really scare me that much. Um, so anyway, yeah, it's a great unit. I like it. 
Um, price was four seventy nine ninety nine at Best Buy. Right now, that's here in the Midwest. I'm not sure if the prices are any different across the country. Um, I would recommend it. I'm not an expert by any means, but for what I was looking for, this is perfect. Uh, speed, responsiveness, screen, uh, the brightness of the screen. Um, I'm sure the more I get into it, the more I'm going to love it. It's really solid feeling. I believe it weighs, I want to say I read somewhere like 3.5 pounds or 3 or three pounds or less or something like that. Um, this Chromebook that I got right here weighs, man, it, 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 it's a smaller screen and I really feel like it weighs about the same. So, either way, for the two-in-one, if you're looking for a two-in-one or a convertible laptop, the Livono uh, Yoga 2, I'd recommend it. Um, another particular thing I loved about this purchase, or just about any purchase I'm doing now, is uh, I was looking through, uh, I was looking for a good uh, rewards credit card uh, to pay off monthly, but pay off a lot, you know, pay a lot of bills with it and, and earn that reward back, cash back reward. And I got one, and then while I was studying some new ones, I found another program that I'll tell you about and tell you how I got $33.70 back on this purchase. And I'll get to that in just a second. Anyway, let's go back. That takes you back to that screen. That takes you back to that screen. So it's a good machine. I recommend it. I'd tell you more if I had more time to play with it, um, but there's some other good videos out there. A lot of good, a lot of good uh, reviews on Amazon and on Best Buy's website. Uh, so check those out if you're looking for the, a lot more technical specs. So anyway, once again, this will probably be the mode I use it in the most, getting ready for bed, right by the bed on the nightstand because I got my Netflix installed on it. So thanks for watching. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you a little bit about how I got the cash back on it. And appreciate it. Thanks. So hey guys, I've, I've got the Chromebook out here. This, the Lenovo, oops, I don't know if you can see it. The, the Lenovo, uh, I'm just using the Chromebook right now because I had this page pulled up. So anyway, what I want to show you is uh, while I was finding cashback programs or studying cashback programs, I found doobly.com and just to give you a an idea. So I bought this last night, and as you can see here, BestBuy.com order number, um, price four seventy nine ninety nine, regular cash back four dollars and ninety cents, membership cash backs twenty eight dollars and eighty cents. Now this is a completely separate program from anything that you might have at Best Buy or any of your other uh, rewards places. Doobly.com is an online mall that has over 4,000 plus retailers worldwide. Um, so I'll show you how I actually made the purchase. Just go to the, the shopping mall. Come down, type in Best Buy. Shows you the terms of that retailer. That's another thing I don't like about this Chromebook. I need to get some better. I'm having some problems with some pop ups on this thing. Anyway, the terms for the Best Buy was no cash back on iPhone 6 gift cards, warranties, or Geek Squad, Geek Squad services, or transactions on third-party websites. Not a problem. So you click, uh, you see right here, if you sign up as a free member, you'd get 1% cash back. A premium member, 5% cash back. A VIP members, which is the way I signed up, you get 7% cash back. Click go to store. You're on your way to Best Buy. It takes you straight to the Best Buy website. 
and this is Best Buy's website. This is not doobly.com. It's Best Buy's website, but you were brought there through doobly.com. Even though I already have a Best Buy account, I went through doobly.com and went and found... I was actually at the store when I did this. I was at the store, and I used the app on my phone. Placed the order, um, paid for it right there while I was in the store, and chose pick up at store excuse me and oops I hit the wrong one chose pick up at store had to wait a little bit because it, I think they tell you to wait like 45 minutes or wait for your confirmation email before you come to the store to pick it up but um, I really wanted just to test to see if I would get the cash back Uh, by doing in-store pickup, and I absolutely did. In fact, it showed up um, in my account the next day. So right down, right there, it says four dollars and ninety cents in regular cash back, membership cash back twenty eight dollars and eighty cents. Came to thirty three dollars and seventy cents. I'm getting back on this purchase I was going to make anyway. Um, man, I can't. I I love that. That's awesome. And I just joined this, to be honest. But let me show you here. Here I got Walmart. Ordered a bunch of stuff from Walmart the other day. Getting seven percent cash back on everything I got from Walmart. Dollar General. Ordered a bunch of stuff from them the other day. On online, delivered it to my door for free. I'm getting nine uh, percent cash back from them. Um, check this out. Groupon. This is a Groupon deal right here for a local restaurant that I was already getting 50% off on the deals that I was buying. I'm also getting 8.4% uh, 8 cash back from Groupon on that. So this is a really cool program, guys. If you're a, you, you do any shopping online, and if even if you don't, I never shopped online from Walmart before, before I signed up for this. But now anything that I would buy at Walmart that they have on their website that they will ship, I'm not going in the store anymore. I'm going to order it online. I order groceries online. I mean, the, the only you know, there's a few things that they don't. You're not, they're not going to sell any meat or cheese or perishables. But a lot of your non-perishables, your canned goods, everything else, all online. You get seven percent cash back from Walmart. Ten point six percent cash back from Walgreens. Nine percent Dollar General. Home Depot, eight point five percent. Lowe's, eight percent. Target, I think, is seven percent. Sam's Club is seven percent. Macy's is in there. Bass Pro, PetSmart, GNC, Groupon. There's, uh, there's, literally, um, more than four thousand places you can order from and get cash back on. So, just wanted to show you that. If that's something that you guys would be interested in, I'll leave a link to the website that you can sign up under. Um, I'd appreciate it if you used my link because anybody that does sign up that way, I get a little extra money for that as well. So thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy your shop.